When I was a little girl, I want to say about in third grade, nine years old, I remember this guest speaker came into the classroom and he asked this little girl in the classroom, which she was, uh, she was a daughter of immigrant parents, first generation in the United States from immigrants. He asked her, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you want to go? And with enthusiasm, this little girl said, I want to go to Rome. At that time, he replied, ah, Italy. And then he said, she said, no, Rome. And then she said, and then he replied, well, that's where Rome is at, in Italy. This little girl had just seen a picture of the Colosseum when she was a little girl and in all her journey, all her dream was to one day be given that opportunity to go to Rome and to see the Colosseum. I would like to introduce you to that little girl. That little girl is me. My name is Yvonne Godinez, and in 2021, I was given the opportunity to travel a Mediterranean cruise with family and accomplish my childhood dream. In this class, I hope to obtain the tools and the knowledge and the skills that I need in order to proceed with my dreams. My next journey and chapter in my life, I am a late bloomer going back to school back in 2015, but I have obtained three associates and now I've narrowed it down to only one bachelor's. That would be public administration. I would like at which I have been accepted into NEU and I will be participating with them this fall. I would like to leave you with a poem that I heard in 1993 and has held dear to my heart. It is by Tom Hopkins. This is the poem. I am not judged by the number of times I fail, but by the number of times I succeed. And in the number of times I succeed, it is a direct proportion to the number of times I can fail and keep trying. This poem holds dear, and I have dedicated this poem to my son, who he has been the inspiration to my life. And I teach my children and my grandbaby that there's nothing that will stop you from your dreams. It doesn't matter if now they are second generation. If you set your priorities and your goals in place, you can achieve anything that you would like. So with that, keep striving and keep reaching for the stars. Thank you for your time.